everyone. Wishing everyone a happy new year, happy 2023. I'm here at Daytona Beach Shore. It's actually, actually an area of Daytona Beach called Port Orange at the Ponce Inlet. And I'm gonna be showing you some of the some of the worst damage to residential properties in Port Orange that's a little bit south of Daytona Beach and some of this is very tragic and just want the families to know that our thoughts and prayers are with them and also wishing everyone the best of health and success in 2023 and I just want to show you some of these residential properties and try not to get any of the addresses in the video. Also a police officer told us that we are allowed on this beach and that they do plan to rebuild these properties so we wish them the best in 2023 and the future. So let's have a look you guys. Really tough for the crews to get out here 
such a short window of time, and I'm sure that they go to the highest bidder, the person willing to pay the most to get, I'm sure, a limited enough number of crews out here. With limited number, limited daylight hours of low tide. Because when it was high tide, couldn't even get out here. The water was all the way up to this seawall. You can see that this seawall right here is pretty strong. So I'm trying to be careful not to get people in my camera view. There's a few people walking on Christmas today. And coming up, not as much damage. I know in my other video I kind of showed some of the most unfortunate damage in Daytona Beach Shores. But I'll just film a little bit more of the damage. South Daytona Beach shores. And uh, sounds like a lot of people want to rebuild, but it's just going to take time. It's going to take manpower. probably saw the worst of the damage and according to the Daytona Beach Police Department that I talked to what you saw was probably the worst of it and they seem optimistic so I'm really excited to maybe give you guys some updates in the future of what Daytona Beach Shores is going to do to rebuild and create this their seawalls again everyone is having a wonderful holiday and a happy new year and happy 2023 you guys.